We're gonna react wow. where we act. Yeah. I don't really think that they have much of a... I feel like this is... I've seen worse trailers. Yeah, I've seen worse ones too. You're right. So have I. Anime shouldn't be translated directly to cinema. I yes, think that they should absolutely. have completely it's rethought not. the way that they were going to do it. And I just think that they don't really have much of a much of a cinematic vision. And this is what I saw like with the first clip, right? Like that's probably a scene that probably this this probably comes straight out of a panel in the manga or the anime, right? Like I'm not sure. I'm just kind of not. guessing it's something that's <laughs> it kind of similar. Absolutely to that. Does some not. people are saying yes, some people are saying no. Let me ask about another one. Because I do the think like on? what he has to say about the whole cinematic uh whatchamacallit vision, I one million percent agree, and I think that's why uh Cowboy Bebop flopped. I think the, the vision argument for anime is like the most important, right? It's it's exactly what I said last time. You don't need to replicate something, you need to translate it, you know? And that's exactly why I think things like The Walking Dead worked so, so well, even though it was a goofy comic book about zombies. But when it was translated into live action, it was like mega dark, you know? It was great. On her head? Yeah, well, that part's fine. Like that right there, this... Wait, hold up. What did he say about Mihawk? Yeah, well, that part's fine. Like that right there. Mihawk's this, badass. Like that kind of stuff. Like that just, it looks stupid to me. Like especially this part here. Like this is just, it just looks stupid. Well, this is kind of goofy, but the same thing happens in The Witcher. So. It looks fake. Yeah. It. it a hater? Well, I'm not a hater. Like I've never really watched One Piece. So maybe like I'm not maybe the the fans of One Piece really like it and I'm I'm wrong but I just feel I like I think it looks great. This is this is what I think. I think that whenever you port something that's anime to real life live action you have to drastically change the way that things are portrayed in a huge way. And I think that if you try to one to one the anime it's just going to look stupid. Straight up, it's just going to look stupid. And for for the most part, I agree. And I think that's what we're already seeing with the uh, with the um, live action version. It will be, I mean, again, I've repeated this a hundred times. The tone for me is by far the most important. And I think so far they've, they've nailed it, you know? Whereas when you look at, and that, I said this again also yesterday, the fact that One Piece seems to have a solid, like again, I, I also thought this with Cowboy Bebop, so let's not jump the gun. But the fact that from the trailer, One Piece, One Piece of all things, has seemed to have gotten the tone down, as opposed to something like Death Note or Monster or something that is more grounded, like, how does the live action version of Death Note seem more goofy than the anime? How does that happen? How can you translate something about a dude sitting in a chair and writing down names in a notebook to live action and make it seem stupid? How does that happen? <laughs> you know? Like this, this, that part is even like, I think even that's like kind of like, this is okay. You know, this is like, I mean, fuck, there's been stupid shit like this in, uh, in, in like X-Men, right? I don't know. I just think that you have to, it's very cartoonish. Yeah. But like, there's a certain level of that's Luffy's signature move. Uh, I mean, you could show it, and I, I don't know, like, I mean, that, that, that's the problem, right? Is like, anime is often used as a foundation to tell a story that is too fantastical for real life. Yes, absolutely. The reason why animation exists is because there is a much, much stronger, like, suspension of disbelief, right? And it's the same reason why things that work on paper might not even work when animated. You know, that is the reason why these stories work so, so well on paper. And even when you try to translate them into something animated, it looks weird. And so how do you make that? How do you, how do you, how do you do this? I don't Which, by the way, like another reason, you know, I, I, I use The Walking Dead all the time because I think that's, that's the best example for like tone. When people get shot in a comic book, it doesn't really carry the same weight as when people are getting shot in live action. You know, in live action, you sort of scrutinize it a lot more because it's, it's a person. You know, whereas on paper, you're just like, oh, you know, it is what it is, you know. And I think it's small things like that, that like you can't, can't overlook. You need to pay attention to those small things. And if we compare it to something like The Last of Us, which, you know, in the game is go, go, go. Joel is a monster. He mows down everyone without, without a second, uh, without a second's um, thought. 
the, the, the sort of adaptation toned it down a lot, which is exactly why I think the translation pro uh, process is, like, the most important, you know? And it's also why, so far, I think One Piece is doing a great job. Because to me, this is walking the thinnest of lines between live action and serious and anime and goofy. And that is a line that, if they manage to walk it all the way through, this might go down in history as a very, very, very good series. No, I mean, I don't even think, I don't think the character design we'll is see. a problem at all. I think that the only good part of this is this scene right here. I think, I, I'll be honest, now that I've watched the trailer like a hundred times, I do think the Roger scene is probably my favorite one out of all of this. I'm not going to lie. Just how deranged and how like, which again, translating the medium, right? In, in the anime, Roger's speech is sort of more goofy. It's sort of more, more lighthearted and it is still serious and it hits hard, but it's sort of this, oh, I left it all in one place. Now you just have to find it. Ha 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 ha. In the live action version, this dude looks like a pirate. Like, there are no two ways about it. Like, this, even his teeth being, like, one million percent yellow. This dude is a pirate, and you know it. It is, is great. actually, like, insanely fucking good. This scene is badass. This is so good. Like, the character design is so good. Like, the, his outfit, everything like that. It's this, great. in my opinion, I love the Roger like, scene. phenomenal. Yeah, like, look at this. Like, this is a pirate king, and everyone knows it. This is how the Pirate King looks like. Yeah, I, I like this a lot. Because it looked like it was actually cinema. It looks terrible compared to the anime, it's not. Well, I, I, I don't- I 1 million percent disagree. Compared to the anime, this looks perfect. I don't know, I, I just, I like the way this looks better than the other stuff. I see your point where most people would relate it one-to-one -one with the anime. You're not wrong, That's I don't agree with it. Oh, I, I know that. Not everything should be a one-to-one -one copy. Yeah. It's like, I'm not, like, I've never really watched One Piece, so, like, a lot of this, I'm kind of coming into it from an outside perspective. Which is good. So I could see where some people might think that I'm, like, a bit off, and I can't really say that I'm not. And, th and this is, like, the most important thing. People immediately jump to, you don't know what you're talking about. That literally does not matter. That does not matter at all, because you want to hear the opinions of people who don't know what they're talking about. You know why? Because they're also going to be watching the show. There won't be a Netflix person sitting at the gates and asking you, have you have you read One Piece? Have you watched One Piece? Well, then you can watch this as well, you know? People need to, to think this is good, who have never seen One Piece. They can't think that it's too goofy. They need to, like, get into it, just like we are, you know? With that, all I can say... So anybody who criticizes it for whatever reason, it is valid, you know? It's not just like, oh, you don't know what you're talking about. No. Is that it's not. I just feel it like it like looks that. campy and like, I don't really take it seriously. And I don't think it's because of the age of the actors. And I actually think that the actor, like the main character actor for Luffy, from what I understand about Luffy, I actually think it's a pretty good, it's a pretty good cast. Yes. Yeah, I, I, I think it's kind of a, a Like good... the cast is S tier across the board from what I've seen so far. Cast. But I don't know. As I said, I never really watched the show. Like, if they look, if they do a Sword Art Online Overlord, uh, Sword Art Online, I, I followed this very closely for for what I think are obvious reasons. But Sword Art Online has been in development hell for the past, I I believe, seven years. I don't think it's happening, unfortunately. So, heard, uh, fucking. I never watched the JoJo's Bizarre Adventure one. If they do oh Ghost in the Shell, Full Metal Alchemist. Full Metal uh, Alchemist? Then, oh no. I mean, if they make a good one. Then then you can see me complaining. Berserk, then, yeah, if they do Berserk uh, live action, then... I I've read Berserk up to chapter 56, I believe, and I can see why it hasn't been adapted. I can see why. <laughs> I can see why. I will have, uh, then I will have a lot more to say, okay? They did do Ghost in the Shell? Oh yeah! Well, I never heard about it after it got released, so I think that says a pretty good amount. Maybe it was good. They did do Full Metal Alchemist, it was ass and it was Netflix. Yes. Yeah, I didn't see it at all. I think that goes to show a lot. When will they do a good Berserk movie? Um, probably never. They shouldn't. I think they could, I, I think they could do it. I feel like in terms of anime, Berserk is actually extremely grounded. It's really grounded. It is, it is really, really grounded, but I don't think anybody wants to adapt it because it is like... 
there is no ambiguity about the age rating and anything that is like strictly 18 plus is kind of like it's a bad business decision you know like it's as simple as that rounded that's Thank why you. shonen is so popular you can for golden age yeah I, I think so for sure minus the demons what i mean is that like like why couldn't you have um guts and, and griffith fighting zod like why couldn't you have that in like that basement i feel like i feel like that's possible sure the zod would look awful in live I action, no. I think that I mean, I the think... Balrog looked great in Lord of the Rings. Yeah, exactly. Like, so, like, what you're really saying, and, and like, look at, like, think about it like this. I think that, like, p like pre Endgame Avengers, like, especially Infinity War and Endgame, look at Thanos. Thanos I is cool. I think Berserk, from what I've read so far, would work in live action. Like, I think if it had, like, a Game of Thrones budget, I think they could pull it off in live action. Perfect, man. It's so good. So, it's not that it's impossible. It's just that it probably is going to be bad. And I think that also, like, yeah, and he's purple. Uh, they do, 1997 anime. Uh, like, Pirates of the Caribbean movie? Yeah, look at dude. Yeah, look at uh, dude. Like, uh, Davy Jones in Pirates of the Caribbean. Davy that Jones in Pirates of the Caribbean looks insane awesome. insane that they actually made that work. And, like, nobody ever... T I, I, I never really hear people talking about that, but you're totally right. Like, the entire crew, like, Will Turner, like, the fucking, uh, Orlando Bloom's dad, like, with the shit on his face. It was insane, man. It was so Berserk good. Berserk doesn't even have a decent animation. Of the animation. Rings. I know. Well, those are actual actors. I know. Budget, I guess? Maybe. Yeah, I think that could be it. The Kraken? Uh, in what, Transformers? Yeah, Transformers was f insane. I watched Transformers, yeah. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be totally on, and I don't know if this is, like, me, me mega coping, but with everything happening in the anime scene with series like, like, uh, like Attack on Titan, and, um, even Chainsaw Man, I do think there is a chance, a chance, that we might get a Berserk adaptation. Like, a new one. This might be me coping. Because, I really want one, you know. Uh, I'm gonna keep reading it, obviously, Actors and then, then then I'll see. Because I think it only gets like worse. Obviously, not worse in terms of quality, but worse in terms of the content uh, from uh, from here. So maybe, maybe, maybe I'll change my mind. Your candidates for grits uh, for uh, guts or Griffith? Um. Hmm. Yeah, smog. Yeah, look at smog. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'd have to really think about it. Anyway, um, as I said, I think that the. Um, I think the characters and all that, like, I don't really watch the anime at all. I just think that, I, I don't know, I just think that some of the scenes here are just kind of, just kind of a little bit silly to me. I mean, fair enough, I guess. From an outsider looking in, I guess, yeah, it looks kind of goofy, but that's what we want. Uh, again, we'll have to make up our minds when we actually get to it, but I think it's good. We'll see. We'll see.